That was Billy Ward and the Dominoes. If you're from out of town, be sure to visit Diamond City. It's safe, it's secure, and it's full of... ...quality establishments like this. Commonwealth weaponry. It's a day in the world out there. Protect yourself. Protect your family. Here's Benny Hunt singing about the man she just can't stand.
Hey, hold up there. First time in good neighbor? You can't go walking around without insurance. Insurance? I'm listening. That's right. Insurance. Personal protection, like. You hand over everything you got in their pockets, or accidents start happening to you. Big, bloody accidents. Someone steps through the gate the first time, they're a guest. You lay off that extortion crap. What do you care? He ain't one of us. No love for your mayor, Finn? I said let him go. You soft, Hancock. You keep letting outsiders walk all over us. One day, there'll be a new man. Come on, man. This is me we're talking about. Let me tell you something. Now why'd you have to go and say that, huh? Breaking my heart over here. You all right, brother? I'm fine. Thanks for taking care of him. Good. Now don't let this incident taint your view of our little community. Good neighbors of the people, for the people. You feel me? Everyone's welcome. Good neighbor? That what you call this place? That's right. We cobbled this little neighborhood together out of the freaks and misfits that just wouldn't be accepted anywhere else. You'll see. You make enough friends here, you'll call this place home soon enough. So long as you remember who's in charge. What's up? Hey, hold up there. First time in good neighbor? You can't go walking around without insurance. You better back off, or you're the one who's gonna need insurance. Whoa, whoa, hey, all right. We'll just say your insurance is paid up for now, okay? Whoa, whoa, whoa. time out. Someone steps through the gate the first time, they're a guest. You lay off that extortion crap. What do you care? He ain't one of us. No love for your mayor, Finn? I said let him go. You soft Hancock. You keep letting outsiders walk all over us. One day, there'll be a new man. Come on, man. This is me we're talking about. Let me tell you something. Now why'd you have to go and say that, huh? Breaking my heart over here. Now I know you had old Finn handled back there. But a mayor's gotta make a point sometimes. You all right? You. You're a ghoul? That's right. Like my face. I think it gives me a sexy King of the Zombies kind of look. Big hit with the ladies. Listen, a lot of walking rad freaks like me around here. So you might want to keep those kinds of questions on the low burner next time. Good neighbors of the people, for the people. You feel me? Everyone's welcome. Yeah, I feel you. Good. You stay cool. And you'll be part of the neighborhood, so long as you remember who's in charge. Hey. Do you need something from me? I need to ask you something. Have you found someone that can help me become human? I haven't found anyone yet. Please, continue your search. You should wash your hands after that. It can be unsanitary to handle the deceased. 
Whoever this Brotherhood of Steel is, I'm not buying that we come Whoever in peace. Whoever this Brotherhood of Steel is, I'm not buying that we come in peace malarkey. Hi. Brotherhood of Steel, better stay out of good neighbor. All I'm saying. Excuse me. Oh, a new face walks into my store. And you're not even screaming yet. Very polite. You let me know if anything catches your fancy. Did you say something about people screaming at you? That's right. Some newcomers have never seen a ghoul before. Can't handle a friendly face, I say. So you need some supplies? Got any work? I do, actually. Super mutants have taken over the old Boston Public Library. I got a lot of fond memories of that place from when I was a girl and... human. You get those lumbering brutes out of there, I'll pay you 200 caps. What's a super mutant? They're big, green, and destroy or kill anything they come across. Except other super mutants. That's why I'm putting up the money. What do you say? You got a deal, Daisy. Thanks. Hey, while you're there, could you return this book for me? It's from the library. Don't even ask how long it's been overdue. Daisy. Don't be shy now. Chances are we have whatever you're looking for. Sure. Let's take a look. All the supplies, money, or violence can buy.
Oh, you're bad. Can't get enough looks of this lovely figure of mine. <laughs> no. Uh-huh. Let's see what you got. It's a little bit of everything. Time now for some news from the Commonwealth with me. In an unexpected turn of events, the quaint little town of Covenant has turned up completely deserted. Details are sketchy, and by sketchy, I mean they're non existent. The whole town is just gone. Those folks always sounded nice, so I do hope they're all safe wherever they've gone to. And if they suddenly turn up again someday, you can. Bet you'll hear about it first here on Diamond City Radio. Here's a classic from Billy Holiday. It's easy living. Excuse me. Yeah. Hell of a load you're carrying. Better sell some to Daisy before someone swipes it. Well, hello. Everything here is guaranteed to injure, maim, or kill at your discretion. Except me. I only kill when I want to. Who... what are you? I'm a woman, baby. Can't you tell? You certainly look like a woman, yes. Then that's all that matters, right? Now are you buying what I'm selling? So, what kind of weapons do you have? Anything that can kill a man, I sell. Except suicidal depression. That is unfortunately not packageable. Now, are we doing bit? Sure, let's take a look. Each weapon tested on someone who deserved it.
Excuse me. Running from something? Welcome home. <laughs>